<laughs> hey, what's up? Hello. Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Soy. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we have a very, 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 very fun video. We're doing a taste test video. Oh my god, the lighting is so weird. Like, half of it, it's like I don't have a hand. You see this? This, this, the shadow play is not gonna work because I'm gonna film this video and get really annoyed when I edit. Anyways, guys, I have a super excited video today for you guys. I am doing a taste test with Wanderlust. It is a local ice cream chain here in locally Los Angeles, California. We're doing a taste test with some of their new flavors. They are now delivery. I've been supporting Wanderlust since pretty much the beginning. When I was like basically a beginning food blogger, they reached out, I went to one of their tastings, mind blown by the ice creams. But I'm really excited about trying these and I wanna try it on camera for you guys. They are famous for some flavors like ube and also like sticky mango rice. There's a couple that started Wanderlust. They based it off of travel and all that good stuff. Now they're actually doing delivery. Yes, delivery. That means that you can have ice cream shipped overnight to you. Jasmine sea salt boba flavor, as well as just boba milk tea flavor. And from what I know, they took a long time R&Ding the process to make sure that the boba balls actually taste like chewy boba balls. So we're gonna be trying that out in this video. And I also have some bread. I literally just got this out of my air fryer because I thought it'd be fun to eat bread with ice cream because that's what we do. And I was having like the hardest time figuring out how to make this video because I was like, are we just gonna wash the spoons? But I got five spoons here. Yes, we're gonna be spooning today. And pandan tres leches. I like that they have the ingredients on the side. Honey butter, baby milk tea, salted egg kaya toast. Oh, inspired by breakfast in Singapore, a toasted bread ice cream with swirl and jasmine tea. Also, you're supposed to like defrost these and I've defrosted them. Let's start off with, let's let's start off with the easiest one, honey butter. I've never had it, but I'm pretty sure this is inspired by Korea. Salted butter ice cream swirled with honey ganache. You know they're fancy when they use the word ganache. <laughs> ooh, ooh, she's creamy, look at that. Definitely defrosted it enough, which makes me really happy because I was worried that I wouldn't defrost it enough. This is the honey butter flavor. Ooh. Oh, that creaminess. And it hits you with a little bit of that caramel. The surprising thing is, it's really light. Mmm, not caramel. Honey, it's definitely honey. Oh, this is addictive. It tastes like a really light milkshake. Oh my god, the honey butter one is so good. This one, perfect with ice cream. Not too sweet, and just a hint of saltiness. I'm not sure what the saltiness Oh, salted butter ice cream. Mmm. Mm, I knew I liked it for a reason. It's a saltiness. I love like salted butter ice cream with something sweet. It's like literally the perfect combination. So far, out of the rankings, this is number one. Also, this is the first one we've done, so it makes sense. Okay, let's start off with a little something easier. Not easier, more progressively unique. This is the pandan tres leche. Sweet cream ice cream with pandan sponge cake. <gasps> There's pandan cakes in here super excited oh you hear that seal of approval so sealing this is what it looks like oh oh i like the texture so i really like their ice cream because they use like ingredients actually in the ice cream for the ice cream look at that the pandan one and you can definitely you can definitely see the bits of like sponge cake in it you guys see it Smells like pandan. I love pandan. Being Southeast Asian, being specifically Vietnamese, we have a lot of desserts with pandan in it. And it is pandan good. Pandan replay? Mmm. Ooh. Really strong pandan flavor. Once again, not too sweet, which I really like. And I don't know how they do it all the time, but the sponginess from the sponge cake is still in the ice cream. It doesn't taste like frozen cake. You know, sometimes when you eat ice cream cake and it tastes really frozen, that's not good, you know? This is delectable. It is delightful. It is a great, powerful taste in your mouth. This might be my new favorite flavor. That's telling you a lot. We're gonna get a little bit more crazy, a little bit more weird. Not weird, weird is good. I'm weird, you're weird. This is a salted egg kala, is it kala toast? Inspired by breakfast in Singapore, toasted bread ice cream with swirls of homemade jam, coconut milk, salted egg, and a hint of pandan. Wow, Southeast Asian coming through with the flavor. Ooh, ooh, the, the, the sponginess from the pandan cake is kind of similar. Look, pretty similar. Don't smell the salted egg, which is a good sign. But sometimes you don't want too much of that. So this is what it looks like right there. Just so soft. I really don't know how they were able to ship this. And I've had this in my freezer for like 
three or four days and yet it's still creamy and it's still really it's magic it's really just magic oh mm. oh she has layers dimension interesting not necessarily my favorite flavor but i'm very intrigued by this i can't understand why it doesn't taste like too salted egg but i taste the hint of pandan and i think that's why i really like it pretty good though no, I, I think it's really good if you want something with a lot of complexity, but don't know why you like it. Like, I'd probably keep eating this not knowing what it was, you know? Can't taste a salted egg, though. Okay, so this is what we're here for. Wanderlust literally released boba milk tea ice cream. You guys know I love boba, I love milk tea, I love ice cream, and I've done many reviews on boba ice cream on my channel, on my Instagram, on my social medias, and I'm really happy that they have their own rendition. They spend a lot of time R&Ding it. <gasps> Oh my gosh, longer. I want to show it to you guys, but I also don't want it to. Oh my gosh, <gasps> I see the boba balls. Oh my God, I'm so excited because I know they spent a lot of time and effort to make sure that the boba balls come out. Do you guys see it? Super real boba. Oh, it smells like milk tea. Promising. I, I really don't know how they do it. Every freaking time they're able to do it. Chewy like boba, but don't expect like super fresh boba because obviously how are you going to freeze it? Super impressed with the texture. It's almost like a mochi texture. The flavor of the ice cream is very floral, very tea tasting and not too sweet. Because of the way it's melted right now, it kind of feels like a milkshake and I'm not going to lie, I don't hate it, kind of love it. We're going to try their jasmine salt, jasmine sea salt boba ice cream, which is their newest flavor. Super excited. I'm literally excited for this whole video. Oh, here's a, here's a little pop. Hey, this is what it looks like. Oh, oh, that jasmine flavor is coming through. This is the boba pieces and the jasmine milk tea one. Mmm, mmm, it's softer than the jasmine milk tea one, which I really like. More chewy. The ice cream itself is a lot more floral and a lot more tea tasting. Mmm. Between the two of them. The jasmine milk tea and the boba milk tea, I think for me, I prefer the jasmine milk tea. There's more dynamic flavor with this one, but they're both really good because they have boba in them. And literally anything that has a boba in them has to be good. That's what I think. Anyways, um, I'm going to be enjoying the rest of these. I don't know if you guys do this, but this is like my favorite snack hack is to take some bread and take some ice cream. I think the winner out of all these ice cream flavors for me is the honey butter. I really didn't expect to like the honey butter that much. That's actually why I did it first. Um, but wow, it, it blew me away. You put it into some bread. It's literally just like, oh my God, butter. Mm. If you want to find out more information about Wanderlust, I'll leave it in the description down below. Thank you for watching this video. Big thumbs up for me to see videos more like this. They're available on Postmates. They're delivery available online. They sell out really quick, so definitely put your timers on. What is that thing? A timer? Or make sure to like follow them on Instagram. They always talk about their launches. Follow me on Instagram because that's the right thing to do. And you know, Joe, love you always. Bye. Okay. Bye, 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 bye.